Good morning, St. Mark's Church family and friends. I am so delighted that you have joined me this morning. would like to just remind you that we will not be having worship services this morning or any activities due to the snow. But I'm so delighted that you tuned in today for a devotion that I'd like to share with you, kind of going along with the snow theme for today. Two passages of scripture, one from Isaiah, one from Psalm. Um, Isaiah writes, Come now and let us reason together, saith the Lord. Though your sins be as scarlet, they, they shall be white as snow. Though they be red like crimson, they shall be as wool. The psalmist wrote in Psalm 51, 7, Purge me with hyssop and I shall be clean. Wash me and I shall be whiter than snow. Let's face it, folks. Life can at times leave us stained. We can be dirtied, bloodied, battered, broken. And yet God promises for every one of us when we turn to him, we can experience the cleansing and washing and healing of God's grace that God has already given to us. We just have to receive it as free gift. We can't clean clean or cleanse ourselves, but we can receive it from God. This is the work of God and God alone. So tomorrow, so today, while we're while you enjoy the Sabbath in the snow, or simply watching the snow from your bay window, remember these words, these life-giving words from Isaiah and from the Psalm. May you find cleansing and healing in your soul as you stay close to God and his word and stay in prayer and, and as you read and reflect upon them. God's peace be with you. Stay safe out there, friends. Let us pray. Lord, we thank you, Lord, for this day that you've given to us, a day of rest. And as we watch the snowfall this morning, Remind us to God of what you've done for us in Christ Jesus, that you have forgiven us of our sins, that you heal us of our brokenness and the consequences of those to restore us and make us new. Continue, God, to help us to walk in your grace, for we know that you are sufficient. 